Philanthropy Connections is a charitable organization based on a simple conviction that if we can help people in need, we should help people in need. Our philosophy is that we try to find local organizations who do excellent work for their communities. They know the people, they know the culture, they speak their language, and they are ideally placed to help their communities. The only thing that they don't have is access to external help. It can be funds, it can be volunteers, expertise, but because of the fact that they don't speak enough English, they don't have the network, we'll never find external help. What we do is we do have the connections, we do have the uh, language skills, and we can try and find help those local organizations that do this excellent job. We have an office in Chiang Mai and from the office in Chiang Mai we are always on the lookout for the kind of organizations that we think need help. What we do is we visit these organizations. We want to know exactly what is going on and we have a set of criteria. The criteria by which we measure the effectiveness and the efficiency of the organization. If philanthropy connections with the set of criteria find that yes, this is an organization that makes a real and positive difference into the lives of the people they are trying to help, then we decide to help them. And the help doesn't stop with just giving the money or connecting them to expert volunteers, but we keep constantly in touch with these organizations. We monitor the projects to see if the money that is given, trusted to us by sponsors, if it's well spent. And the fact that we're here, based in Thailand, gives us the possibility to always easily go to these organizations and check. And we are very well connected to the people who run the organizations. I'm sleepy. <laughs> now, one more time. I'm sleepy. I'm sleepy. Go. The projects are very different. For instance, a program where children with Down syndrome are being taken care of. They live in a center together with other children with mental handicaps. We go there frequently and we can see how the children are progressing. They were in very poor health, they were weak, they were sad and within three, four months they were almost totally different children. And that is something that we report to the sponsor who's sponsoring those two children. And it's not after three months that we stop, but we frequently go there also because the sponsor keeps on sponsoring these children. Connections is very important in the work that we do because we do not only connect the projects with sponsors for money or with volunteers who come to these projects to do work in the field, but we also try to connect organizations that can help each other to help even better. Now, a very nice example of this connection is, for instance, the Warm Heart Foundation, who we connected to the wheelchair project of the RICD hospital. What happened is because we brought these two together, is that the RICD wheelchair project is now also bringing wheelchairs and other mobilities aid to all the elderly and disabled people of the Prao district in uh, northern uh, Thailand. What our sponsors keep on telling us is that they are very happy with the fact that they can see the results of their support. We keep them informed about the progress that is being made in their projects and their money does not disappear but is used in exactly the way they expect. That is the way we work. I'm absolutely delighted with all the support that we have received so far and I am sure that with that kind of support that hopefully will grow in the future, we can do much more for more projects who help people in vulnerable situations to build a more dignified life for themselves.